Right everyone, welcome Collector here. Right, I thought I'd do a quick thank you video for the fundraiser I did recently and show you what I got. So, yeah, it was very successful. I managed to get all of the funds and half again. So yeah, it, it, was, it was brilliant. And yeah, thank you very much for everyone who supported me. I massively appreciate it. So yeah, I'll show you what I got. The first thing is the, is it the eight shot magazine for the, I can never remember if it's seven shot or eight shot. Whichever one it is, the upgraded magazine for the adder. I'll do some videos testing that soon. I have had a shoot of it and it's good. I do like it. I like the mechanism of it. Um, yeah, it's it's very good. It's nice that it's got the open sights on it. I also got the Nox for the Venom limbs. I didn't want to keep changing them so I thought I'd get some so that I can put them on. And I may at a later date even get the mounting bit. So that this never needs to be keep being strung and stuff like that. Because otherwise I have to keep swapping the bolts over. But that's a good start. I did also get a good supply of bolts. Already been using the Vlad bolts. The purpose of these are... With the Vlad ones I want to be able to do some heavyweight bolts. Because I don't think these are good enough for the Vlad 90 pound limb. So I've bought some stuff to reinforce these bolts. And these ones are for making broadhead bolts. Oh that's the one thing I forgot to bring up actually. I got about, oh, I don't know, I'm getting on for 50 broadheads, I think, for making broadhead bolts. Yeah, I've left those downstairs, but that doesn't matter. So bolts, plenty of bolts, and to make heavyweight bolts. And I'll do a video of that showing you how to make heavyweight bolts for your Vlad. These nails are going to be part of that system. They will be inside the bolts, and I bought those as well. For that Venom limb I showed you, which is between 170 to 210 pounds in, in draw weight, I've bought some stuff to reinforce some bolts. So I've bought some aluminium knocks for the bolts, these are the R9 bolts, and some weighted inserts, and a piece of aluminium tubing that will go in the bolts as well. So that will reinforce them and strengthen them and weight, and it will add weight to them so that they will be adequate for that you know, 170 to 210 pound limb. Because how they are when you get them, they are definitely not up for that because they're barely up for 130 pound limbs in all honesty. I did buy another one of these. This is my this one's been modded already, but I've I've put the one I bought away, but I've bought one of these Anglo Arms machetes as well so that I can make a big D guard Bowie knife. Similar to this but with a nice brass D guard. So that'll be coming up soon. I also got some spray paint. I've got three bottles of that. That's for making bayonets. And I've got some silicone spray for the swords and the guns just to maintain them. Bit of super glue for making the bolts. And both the bolts I mentioned will be on YouTube as a tutorial. So I'll show you how to make heavyweight Vlad bolts and heavyweight R9 bolts for the higher limbed crossbows. I bought some 3 mil kydex and some 1.5 mil kydex and that's for making the quivers. So I have invested some of this money into making more money which will be back into the channel again. You know. Chronograph has the arms coming off there so I can now test crossbow poundages, you know foot pounds, air rifle foot pounds and all stuff like that. Anything we can shoot through this I can test to see the power of it. I bought a digital luggage scale for doing the draw weights on some of the crossbows because the one I had isn't high enough basically, it doesn't go high enough. This will go up to I think £150 I think, I can't remember now. Um, yeah so I should be able to, I'm just looking on the back there, I'm not sure. But yeah it will, it will definitely be good enough to test the Vlad, I know that. So I've got that as well. I bought one of these Mantis crossbows which I'll do a full assembly video for you eventually. This really was so that I could make bayonets for it to sell, so there'll be new products coming soon. I'll put my quivers on this and my bayonets and then I can sell them for these, knowing that they will fit all of these, because there's quite a few of these. I think it comes under the, the M48, Hellhawk, um, Mantis, <clears throat> but there are quite a few of this design that could take a bayonet and a quiver. The only things that haven't arrived yet, I think, is some um, scope mounts which will be used for the bayonets and the quivers. 
And I've also bought a 4G mini Wi-Fi box thing so that I can have portable internet now. I can't really do it with my phone. My phone's not good enough to do it. Um, you know, it's just, it's not worth the bother. Whereas this, this is perfect for use with my phone. And this will now mean I can live stream whenever I'm out. So I could go down the woods, go to the field somewhere. And if I'm somewhere completely different, I could live stream there as well. You might see me live streaming down the beach or something like that. Yeah, that is really, really handy. Um, I think it's probably going to cost me about three quid a time if I, you know, if I do a proper like two hour, two three hour live stream. It might cost me about three quid, but I'm fine with that. You know what I mean? I think that's worth it for being able to do that. I'm really happy with that. Excellent. So yeah, that's it. That is what I got with the donations, and I'm very very grateful. The people who donated massively helped the channel. And it supplied all of the things that people kept asking for that I just couldn't do due to money restraints. Because as I mentioned, you'll always get videos, but some cost a lot of money to do. And without that money, I, I cannot do them. Well, I can now. So cheers. Yeah, plenty of content coming. I'm not sure what will be first, but because the problem is it's raining a lot at the minute, which restricts some of the videos. But, you know, since it's not raining, I'll get out, shoot that adder. And do whatever. Right? So thank you everyone. I really do appreciate it. And you, you have added some good content to the channel now. Um, yeah, that'd be good being able to go down the woods and live stream. Won't it? Yeah. Alright? Thank you everyone. I massively appreciate it. If you do want to still support, you still can. There's, a, there's the coffee donations thing. It's just a website where you can donate. The link is in the description. And there'll be a little video at the end showing you how to do it. Because it's quite simple, but... You know, if there's a video, it makes it even easier, don't it? Right. Thank you again. Cheers, everyone. And I'll see you in some future videos. Cheers, everyone. See you later.